Angel, don't run, no running. This is 20 bucks. This whole bag is 20 bucks. Okay. It's a Star Wars lot. Right, it's not gold. Look at that. It's a Five bucks. Okay. Right? And then uh, I got a Three Stooges. Perfect. This one's $12. That's a three fine. Three Stooges MGM Grand. That's jacket. fine. Yeah. Check it out real quick. Let's see if it's messed up, but I don't think it's messed up. It was the only good piece of clothing I found. Gentlemen's Club, yeah, that'll work. Nice, right? 12 bucks, this is deal. Alright, so I got this bad boy. That's 50. So, this is 50? I'm gonna pass on this one. Oh, I thought I think I thought I think something else. And this was paid for. Yeah, that was paid 62. for. 62. You got the money. Oh, and I got this. It's a cool concept, you know, and then he went crazy on the nail gun, obviously. It's just cool to spray. Hey, it's eight bucks. Eight. Yeah, I know. I didn't know you were ready. Come in to me. Phone. Uh... We'll just, we'll just remove the stickers. Clear phone. Yeah. 30, 50, 30. It's a cool display piece. 30. 25. Yeah. I would say 30. I mean, 30 who the fuck is still gonna see it? Even with the stickers, you know what I mean? We'll get them, we'll be able to get the stickers off, yeah. luckily, because it's not colored. So when we put the uh, nail polish remover, it'll just come right off. And there's some pins in the keychains in there too. Um, I'm 13 bucks. Oh. I can put that. I know we don't usually do that, but well, you know we do. yeah, we do. <laughs> nah, I'm with it. Snugger chef. The first GoPro. Right on. Hey, it's your roots. <laughs> <laughs> Papa. <laughs> Pink, pink tag. Oh, 
they give us things Crossfire? Like, what is that? Like pinball? It's like, uh, I gotta check if the things are that old instructor? Yeah. Yeah, they do got them. Ten bucks. It was a. Uh, let me see. Giant playing field. Oh, you like shoot it. Oh, right on. Ten bucks isn't bad. Huh? Ten bucks isn't bad. Look it up. Let's see what it's going for. Yeah. Mm. That's nice. Look at that. On point. What you got? Show me. Hold on. <laughs> Suck it, DX. Right on. That's cool. 2016, but. What's the price? Six bucks. That's not bad. It's All right. It just Take away. it. Yeah. There's more. <laughs> oh, that is so cute. Dude, how much is this? It's Ten bucks. That's dope. No tears? I don't know. I haven't really checked. I just threw it in my cart. I got excited. No, it looks good. He's got you know, little baby stains, but like, that's, that's not bad. A lot of that's cleanable. Cuarenta. Forty bucks. That's not bad, but it's, it's too small, though. Las camisetas? ¿Y esta? Hay otro. Hay otro. 15 por los dos? No, 10 cada uno. Está barato. Ok. ¿Cómo se ve? ¿15? 20. Ah, es 20. Es no tanto. Like. Ah, oh, damn. You can't fix that, huh? You can't fix that. Sorry, they would have been good. You see this tag? You won't believe what I found, love. Gracias. We can leave now. Did you see what I found? Uh, no, what was that? Check what I found. The white one. Two in a week. That's great. Yeah. You gotta throw it. I gotta say it. <laughs> Hi guys. Thanks for watching our video so far. This is number four. And four. Uh, we have some stuff to show you today. Um, unfortunately, uh, we, we went to a couple estate sales and some of our footage wasn't the greatest, but we found a lot of gold. We like to call it gold because. Uh, it sells fast and it's good to have in our booth, so. And we picked up too much bronze and silver at <laughs> different points, so we've learned gold. Bronze and silver, no, no. Gold, gold. Um, let's show you guys what we found. This is some of the things we found. These old vintage Galaxy Warriors, they could sell for, for quite a bit of money. Um, we picked up these Buck Rogers. I, uh, they're packed already. They're ready to sell at our next event in Long Beach, but. 1978, highly collectible. They can go for some good money. We have the Jurassic Park, Dick Tracy, some VR Troopers, and um, Biker Mice from Mars. We also have the Pokemon and Pocahontas, what is it, Polly Pocket? They sell really well for us. Uh, we picked up this Dennis Menace plush. It's just cool for the booth, to be honest. And then these are what I think was uh was the gold um we picked up this vintage sea world hat i think the missus wants to keep this one for herself and i found this los angeles rams uh snapback on a sports specialty tags and since they won the super bowl uh, this hat just goes up in value and uh, my prized possession i've been chasing this hat for like four years and I finally got it. I wanted it in purple, but apparently the yellow one's more rare. It's the Corduroy LA Lakers on a sports specialty tag, and it's clean. You know, 
I'm probably not gonna sell it, but um, you know, money talks, so let me know. And um, I'm gonna pass you over to the missus. She uh, she found some pretty cool stuff too. Catch gotcha. All right, so I have some things to show you also. Uh, first things first, we have a cache size four wedding dress with a cold shoulder neckline, sequin center, and a beautiful beaded lace skirt. Minor seam defects, nothing crazy. I like picking these up, they're good sellers. Um, so I'm happy about that fine, and it's nice to find a wedding dress that doesn't have a big brown splotch on it. Alrighty. And then we have this lovely teal kimono with a tie waist and embossed collar and sleeve cuffs. So happy about this line as well. And then last but not least, my most excited find is this MGM Grand exclusive red leather sleeved letterman jacket with a Three Stooges Gentlemen's Club embroidery on the back. It has the silhouette embroidery, Gentleman's Club in script. Again, some wear on the um, leather, but nothing crazy. So those are our finds. Um, please remember to follow and subscribe. Uh, we'll have new footage out next week as well. And we appreciate uh, all your support. We are big children looking for stuff from our childhoods. Do we know what we're gonna get? No, but we're having fun. Will it be trash or will it be treasure? It doesn't matter cause we're together on a NJ adventure. Digging through this side and whatever. Isn't it funny that granny's funky sweaters were worth some serious money? If you don't like the song, we don't care. It's a theme song with some flair.